not that you might be able to tell at the moment, but this bit here where all these boats are, this is where I swam as a little boy. Oh God, I couldn't have been any more than about maybe four or five years old. But I just remember jumping into the water, I remember it being absolutely freezing cold. And my mum sitting at the corner, I say corner, somewhere about here, going, are you all right? And me going, I think so. Yeah, it's sad that they uh, filled the thing in. Good memories though. So behind me is North Berwick, an absolutely beautiful place, only a short little drive away from Edinburgh, which is that direction. Now, I used to come here as a little boy and I've got great, great memories of it. To me, this was my summer holidays. Uh, and I still come here on quite a regular basis and try and bring my son here quite regularly as well. Uh, there's a helicopter up there. There he is. I'm not saying this is what you have to do when you come to North Berwick, but this is what I normally do when you come here. Now, on Quality Street, you've got the North Berwick Fry, the Ship Inn, and the Landers. Now, the North Berwick Fry, get yourself some fish and chips, and then go along to the little cliffs. And then after that, come for a walk back up here, and then head into Landers. And if for whatever reason it's too cold or too rainy to get yourself some fish and chips, the Ship Inn. Now, they used to do a fantastic hot dog in there. <laughs> Too cold for ice cream. Lobster from the Firth of Forth, which is that body of water over there, it's the best lobster you can get. No ifs, no buts, just enjoy it. And I'm not a fan of lobster, but my God, it is absolutely amazing. And there's a couple of places you can get it. Now it's purely up to yourself which one you go to. The one at the Old Kirk. It is good, uh, I really enjoyed it, but I waited nearly two hours two years ago to get myself uh, my lobster and chips. So yeah, I was starving at the end of that, absolutely ravenous. But then there's a little shed actually in the harbour itself. I would go for the one in the harbour, assuming it's still open after the end of Covid, mind you. Because, well, it looks like a lot of places might not reopen again. <laughs> <laughs> 